vertex plane is being turbine. This is a vertex tube. The column. So this is the piston actually kind of tube pipe. This is the aluminium foil. So this is the vertex tube. These are the two disc plates. Seven inch diameter, six mm thickness. Two disc, one for this side, one for top. So at that time the LED will be glow. So this is the time for glowing the LED. The light up on the top of the LED. Last light up. Okay, don't worry. So let us go on the ground. So it will be the vibration. So the light will be glow. Then this is the piece one fixed piece. Bottom here is the piece one fixed piece with nylon. These are the four spring gate. Eight of them spring gate. Frame model made up of mild steel. Uh, one inch in only three of them thickness. Thickness in the thickness in the size is three feet wide. Next is this is all big connection is going to the amplifier circuit. So this is the amplifier circuit. So this is the amplifier. This is microcontroller, quick microcontroller. This is LCD display. So the generator output is amplified and then it will be stored in a battery. The battery is 12 volt, 78 rechargeable battery, rechargeable battery. Here, displaying the uh, amplified voltage and generated voltage. Two voltage will be coming. So this is the voltage. This is the 1.4 is the input voltage, 15 volt is the output voltage. Atar. So this is the amplifier circuit. The amplifier is battery charging. Then after charging, this is the inverter. This is the inverter, the DC to AC conversion. So this is floor of the inverter. So you have to connect the battery. The light will be glow. So this is the vertex flareless pin turbine by using the vibration force. So with this type of vibration, so that time the power will be generated, will be amplified by the amplifier, will be stored in a battery, the battery to inverter, inverter to fluorescent tube inverter, 40 watts, this is the 12 volt 40 watts inverter. So 40 watt inverter, first you go to connect the tube plate, then you go to connect the battery line. So this is the concept of vector fluorescent tube plate. So it will be checked the charging of more than it will be the people who are concerned so it will be checking the approximately 10 to 12 hours of black metal. Arrivation. That's why that time only the battery will be charging. Now the battery is full charging so that's why it will be done for energy. So this is the thing for the black metal to be a blender to be charged. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it.